By now, most of us have heard of a lateral flow test. They're a diagnostic test that can be delivered at the point of care. Results can be obtained quickly, easily and affordably. They can be developed to test for many different diseases, such as COVID-19, HIV, Ebola and possibly even cancer. But how do they actually work? A person believes they may have an illness and picks up or has delivered the relevant lateral flow test. In the case of a viral disease, the test will look for a specific antigen, which is part of the virus, and will be present in a sample of the patient's bodily fluids, such as blood, saliva or urine. A sample is placed in a well on the test and flows from the sample pad to the conjugate pad. This pad contains antibodies attached to nanoparticles. The antigens in the sample bind to these disease-specific antibodies and flow as an antigen or antibody nanoparticle complex up the test strip. The antibody-antigen complexes will bind to another set of antibodies on the test line. As more nanoparticles bind to the test line, they produce a detectable signal, such as a coloured or fluorescent line. If no disease-specific antigens are present, the first set of antibodies will not attach to the test line. The control line captures all antibodies, regardless of antigens being present. A line will appear to indicate that the test is valid. iSense are developing mobile technology and online care pathways to accompany their tests, making it easy for users to interpret their test results and send them to their GP.